What up boys and welcome back to another gold farming video. So in this video we're going to be farming another material for the vial of sands. We're going to farm this one right here, the deep stone oil. And the deep stone oil is needed to uh, craft the vial of sands as I said and you need 8 of these in order to craft one. So there's a lot of potential because vial of sands is one of those mounts that is crafted and sold every single day. And I got tipped from uh, some viewers. I asked my viewers if you had any farming tips in my one of my previous videos. And one of you guys called Trolling for Monies told me about this one. So thank you so much for letting me know about it. It's a great farm. It really is. So when it comes to location, we're going to be fishing in Deep Home. It's the only place you can find these fish. And you can see the pools right here. I'm going to leave a link on this right down below in the description. And I went ahead and I did a one hour session. You can see my stopwatch right here. And you can also see there's a lot of pools around me. Like there's a ton of them. And there's almost no competition whatsoever so in one hour i managed to get myself 201 of uh, the albino cavefish and i got 31 volatile water like the market value on this is over 10,000 gold for the cavefish and a thousand gold for the volatile water so i basically made 11 uh, 11 and a half thousand gold in market value in one hour that is pretty damn sick and these fishes like they will sell People uh, people buy these materials all the time. I checked on WoW Auction and at least on my realms and a few of the other realms I checked, they sell every single day. So it's definitely worthwhile to take a um, help. But uh, I mean, you can see on my realm, there are currently uh, 25 gold, but they're not. there was like four of them up on the auction house though. So I'm just going to buy those up and put these up for a lot more. But definitely check out your auction house and see if it's worth it on your realm. Because if they're 20 gold each, you're only going to make like 4 5k gold. Counting the volatile water if that is, has it like a decent price. But uh, yeah, this is a really good farm. A steady, steady farm. Because uh, this is not like arcane crystals. These materials are used way more, way more often. So I would definitely recommend you to try this out. So... Uh, one more tip before I go is to get this one, this add-on right here, server hop, because sometimes when you finish up fishing in all the pools, you're gonna you're gonna run around and you might find find one in one pool every now and then. You don't need to server hop because you will always have one pool up, but server hopping makes it a lot more easier. You can just stand in one spot. Once you've fished these pools right here, you can just jump realm and you will have a lot of pools close to each other again. So I would definitely recommend it. And yeah, that's about it for this video. So if you guys have any tips like uh, trolling for money sat, please let me know either down in the comment section, send me a PM on uh, Facebook or YouTube or whatever. I really appreciate them. And uh, as long as I have like a fate in, uh, in the tips, I will check them out. Like uh, as I said in the previous video, if you guys go ahead and uh, tell me to farm linen cloth in Westfall, I'm not going to do it. But uh if I can make see some sense and see some uh, see some value in the tips you're telling me about, I will definitely give it a go. And that's it for this video. So if you like this video and you want to see more videos like this, feel free to press the sub button right down here. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye bye. Thanks for watching.